It so was. you started with an audition tape, mm -hmm. and then you got called out to cast. So you get called out. You're going to L.A. Were you familiar with the show, The Sweet Life of Zach and Cody? Yeah, I watched it all the time. Oh, my and gosh. I knew it, and I had never been to L.A. before. And so they came out, and they brought me out, and it was just unbelievable. I'm so. sure. So you're, you know, you're a fan of the show. You know the powerhouse that is the Disney Channel and the yeah. importance of this audition. What was the actual audition like? Were you with any of the existing characters? I was. I was with Brenda Song and Dylan and Cole Sprouse, who play London Tipton and Zach and Cody. And um, I, just, I went in there, and I was reading against two other girls. And I went in there, and I was the only one that got called back. And uh, I didn't want to get my hopes up, but I sure. thought that was a good sign. And mm -hmm. then you booked it. And then I booked it. And then you start <laughs> shooting. So you live in Keller. You guys have a house out here. Yes, we do. Um, and so you're kind of back and forth. Mom has uh, bared the slings of air and arrows of your <laughs> acting career. So then you go out, and you're shooting in L.A. How many episodes have you shot? Um, we've shot about 20, and I was in about 16 of them. Wow, that's a lot. Of, okay, so how does that work with you? I mean, you obviously have to pick up, leave your friends. You're leaving school, everything that you know in North Texas. Were you ready to make the transition? Um, ready? I don't know. <laughs> but, you know, I did it, and I had a lot of people that really supported me the whole time. You know, they said they would miss me, but they always send me phone calls and text messages and care packages letting me know they're thinking about but, me. So. Okay, well, we're familiar with this show, This Week Like of Zach and Cody. What makes this show different? Is it a little bit older now? Is everybody kind of growing up on the show? People are growing up. They're still Zach and Cody, so they still have their shenanigans, but they're definitely, they're growing up, and they're more mature, and London is kind of taking more responsibility for herself, and then we're also on a boat, and so we're traveling to different ports of call, and we're seeing the world, which is really, really fun. Okay, so you're still in class. It's like a semester at sea. So a some of those, like, like you said, those existing characters are on there, and I believe Mr. Mosby, and, yes, he and is. everyone is still there. So what was it like to enter into a, a, a set that was already in process, so or already in progress? Are you kind of nervous? Um, it's kind of like starting the first day of school all over again to exactly. meet everybody? I was intimidated, but um, you know, I went in there, and everyone, they all have kind of have their, their flow, and they know how to do what they're doing mm -hmm. and so coming in there and you know just kind of being thrown in it was it was hard, but um, there were a lot of people there that really wanted me to feel at home and comfortable, and so I don't know what I would do without like the writers and the entire production team, as well as, you know, I've learned a lot from Dylan and Cole and Brenda That's and true. Phil. It sounds like you're really grateful and that you're having a really good time out there. You know, a lot of times, you know, you uh, being a teen star, certainly on the Disney Channel, you bear the slings of arrows of being in the limelight, and we've seen many of the teens on Disney Channel bear the slings and arrows of being <laughs> in the limelight. How do you handle that pressure to, to be a good role model for those kids that look up to you? I um, yeah, I'm a kid. <laughs> I just think about, you know, when I was back home babysitting, the kind of person that I was and the kind of role model that I was for the kids I would babysit, and now it's just kind of that on a grand scale. Okay. And so I just think about, you know, being myself, and I know that, you know, what I stand for, it has to be really, really strong when I go out there because I've kind of seen it press, but uh -huh. as long as I've got the support team, which I have. And I'm you've got your mom good. in the studio right now who She's brought you awesome. in here. I know, it's really <laughs> great. So you've got, a, obviously, a strong tie with your family. They're going back and forth from North Texas to L.A. for you. Yeah. What do you miss most about Keller? Do you miss your friends? Do you miss your school? Yeah, I miss my school. I was on drill team there. So I was a, I was a dancer and I was very plugged in. That I miss a lot. I miss that a lot. And um, my church, I was really plugged in there and we would always hang out outside and it was just so much fun. But. What do your friends and family here think of this whole you know, experience that you're <laughs> that you're on TV now? Is it kind of surreal for them too? It's definitely surreal because, you know, occasionally it's like they'll flip it on and there I am. You yeah. know, and they'll, they just freak out. But they um they support me a lot you know they they tell me how proud they are of me and just they keep me strong and i don't know what i would do without them I'm so i'm sure they do well it's really great chatting with you debbie when can we Thank see you. the sweet life on deck when is the air on fridays at 8 7 central fridays and it's already in a, on 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 play right it's yes, already in there and, and it's running it premiered late september Okay. And we've got new ones every Friday. Very cool. Well, welcome back to North Texas. Thank Go you. enjoy uh, some North Texan fun and <laughs> see your friends while you're here. And it was really great to meet you. And remember, The Sweet Life on Deck, it airs on Friday nights on the Disney Channel.